All right. Okay, we clear props. Props clear. Clear props. Get the brakes. Clear! Model frequency 121.9. You need taxi or clearance, contact ground 121.9. All aircraft feedback runway, Simon and hold short instructions. Use caution for increased bird activity on near the airport. Advise on this contact. You have information Delta. Sarasota Airport, information Delta, special observation 1428 Zulu, wind calm. Visibility hey, 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 hey. statute miles, mist. Ceiling 200 overcast, Hello? temperature 21. I don't hear you at all. No. Uh oh. ILS approaching east, landing, departing runway 14 and 04. Hello. Testing 1 2. I don't know if there's something wrong with the mic or not, Phil. I can't hear anybody or not. I can't hear us. 1 2 1.9. -er. All aircraft feedback runway, Simon and Hello. Hello. No. Cost for increased bird activity on near the airport. Advise. That wasn't plugged in all the way. Information Delta. Let me see, you're on the one here. Sarasota Airport, information Delta, special observation, 1428 Zulu, wind calm, Not right. visibility 3 statute miles, mid. Hello? I hear you better okay. now, what was that? Over uh, what's it plugged in? 1, okay. 2, 1, October 2, 0, 1, 1. ILS approaching east, landing, departing runway 14 and 0, 4. Ground control, clearance, living model, frequency 121.9. If you need taxi or clearance, contact ground 121.9. All aircraft feedback runway, Simon and hold short instructions. Use cost for increased bird activity on near the airport. Advise on this contact. You have information Delta. Information Delta. Delta. Now we'll, I now I can hear it. Let's see okay. what we got. Sarasota Airport. Information Delta. Special observation. One four two eight Zulu. Wind calm. Visibility three statute miles. Mist. Ceiling two hundred overcast. Temperature two one dew point two one. Altimeter three zero one one. ILS approaching east. Landing departing runway one four and zero four. Ground control, clearance, living model, frequency 121.9. If you need taxi or clearance, contact ground 121.9. All aircraft feedback runway, Simon and hold short instructions. Use caution for increased one. productivity yep. on near the airport. Advise on this contact. You have information, Delta. We've got Delta. I'm going to call and get our IFR clearance to get out of here. Okay. So we have three miles visibility, IFR. Good morning, Sarasota. This is uh, Cessna 5297 Gulf. I'd like to pick up our clearance. Number 5297 Golf, Sarasota ground, clear to Sarasota Airport via radar vectors on departure. Fly heading uh, 180, maintain 1,600, expect 3,100 minutes tap. Tampa departure frequency 119.65, squawk 4666. Or 666, that's not a good sign. Okay, uh, 5297 Golf, we're clear to Sarasota via radar vectors after departure heading 180. Uh, uh, 1,600, 3 and 10, 119.65, one, one, squawking 4, 666, and we are ready to taxi from the pilot place with Delta. Cessna 9, Tampa Golf, runway 14, taxi via Foxtrot, Charlie, hold short of the ILS critical area, readback is correct. Okay, Foxtrot, Charlie, hold short of ILS critical area, 97 Golf. All right, sir. Okay, so, want to do it, or me, oh, or? We can, uh, we'll, we'll just get real rolling here. Okay. All right. The so basically, four, what I can say, and just for the sake of, see, I'm, I have a lot of feedback, so I can't really hear real well. Um, it, I don't know. Sometimes there's a short in this, and I'll pull this I out a second. I think it's a bottom. Yeah. The, so we'll see. But can you hear me? I can, I, I can hear you perfectly. I'm struggling hearing. Um, nonetheless, is uh, what we're going to do is the field is IFR, so we are going to file an IFR flight plan. We do know that the tops of the clouds we can see on top of. Yeah. Five Yankee Zulu in uh, but nine seven. We'll get up into Whenever our VFR uh, maneuvers. Then when we come back, this will uh, you can just switch to burn off. Let them know you're ready. This is the first time I've really struggled with the audio. Um, They're good headsets too. Yeah, it's it's intermittent. I, I don't. How about your battery? Brand new. It just changed. Oh okay. <laughs> anyway, um, see, like right now, I hear nothing. I uh, I can hear like a reverberation but it's not clear in my head. How about this, testing one, two, three, four, testing one, two, three, testing one, two. I one, hear two. you there, but I don't know if it's... Testing one, two, check one, two, check one, two. Testing one, two, check one, two. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. hello. Well, 
leave that in for a little bit and see if that has something to do with it. I, I pulled it out a little bit of the okay. bottom. Um, so, and we may not even need IFR at this point, but the field's still IFR. So oh, what, yeah. what they're giving us to do is, and I know I'm going kind of quick today just so we can get out there. Sure. Uh, yeah, uh, the transponder squawk was 466. Oh, I didn't even do that. Thank you for being an amazing first officer here. Because that was different from typically the zero one. Correct. Oh, so yeah. the zero usually will indicate, I believe as such, I'm guessing on this, usually indicates, uh, I see the pattern reoccurring, is that that is usually a um, VFR squawk. Okay. So, but we'll get on top of this mess here and, uh, and then uh, do uh, the lesson that we talked about. Okay. And um, you see all these jets coming in. Oh, so then, yeah. so the the ceilings, so the visibility is great. They can see us, but the other day when I did this, uh, they couldn't see us. So we had to report all of our all of our movement. Okay. But so what they're having us do here is we're holding short of the ILS critical area. And this is a great lesson because this is... Because there's a, typically a line that says ILS. That, which is, we'll see it, and the yep. cameras will see it as we come up here, because that, anything beyond that, our position could interfere, interfere. with the, the glide slope, or the ILS system, rather, which stands for Instrument Landing System. system. So, matter of fact, right now, when we're here... We can do a run-up real quick. Okay. SR-22. Is he moving, or I guess... Uh... Have you flown an SR-22? I have been, I got about six hours in one that a friend of my sister had when I went to Phoenix. Would you feel comfortable flying one? Oh, sure. With us? I think they're amazing. You buy one? No, I have, uh, I can get one for us to use. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm not sure their insurance would cover me with my time. <laughs> anyway, so this is one do run up. You want okay, me to do it? Or? Run up. Okay. Okay. In my checklist, but I probably don't, but we'll use Go it ahead. anyway. And brakes on hold. Mixture full and rich. Throttle 1800 RPM. Three five in Kizulu, use caution, large flock of white birds. Testing um, magnetos to the left. The right side of your runway about the no approach drop, more than and one fifty. left to right over the runway. Five Testing Kizulu, the right. Looking for the bird. No drop, more than 150. No difference between the, between the two. Back to both. Got the temperature in the green, back in the green. Fuel level, fuel flow in the green. At 26, 26 uh, gallons in the left and right. And we'll bring that back down to idle. Okay. Test our thing here. And back up to 1,000. Actually, we'll just keep that at, uh, yeah, back up, up to 1,000 here. Well, perfect. Ready to go? Looks good. Okay. Service for the tower, this is Cessna 5297 Gulf. We are holding short of the ILS critical area. Cessna 5297 Gulf, Sarah said a tower, you can resume your taxi. Would you like runway 14, Charlie 1 intersection departure? There's 9,050 feet available. Uh, sure, nice up, we can take Charlie 1. Number 9,000 Gulf, runway 14, Charlie 1, clear for takeoff. Use caution for a large flock of white birds. Have been circling around the approach end of runway 14. Okay, appreciate that, and we will, uh, for 97 Gulf, we'll take Charlie 1, clear for takeoff. Uh, Charlie one. Oh. Okay. Would you hit the um, lights camera action for us? Camera action, strobe on. Yep. Uh, actually, turn the strobe off. And the only reason is because in the clouds, some, uh, a lesson is to learn is that uh, it sometimes it reflects off the clouds. Okay, gotcha. Okay, so you'll see a benefit here of being able to the fly. Nav on. Nav on. Uh, I don't know if we really need it. Yeah, go ahead for practice purposes. <laughs> Um, I mean, you see where we are right now, and yep. this is something that you can see. Um, you see the overcast. We're going to take oh, off yeah. up out of here, and we are clear for takeoff. We got everything yeah. ready to go. Altimeter, and away we go. Move us up here. After departure, our heading is going to be uh, 180. 180. 
airspeeds of five. Divine. There's 50, 55. I'm going to wait till we get to about 60, and then I'll do a slow rotation. I still breaks. All right. And it's going to be really uh, see the benefit of having an instrument rating now, right? Yes. How much more uh, training for IFR? Traffic you know what? It's not. Um, I'll say it's it's. This is the this is the foundation. It's what you're doing right now. Okay. And once you get this, it's. I don't want to say it's easy. It's not easy. I found it a much more fun. This is a great video. You caught the last one, right? What's Seven nine zero showing golf, heading one eight zero. Contact Hampton departure, good day. Okay, one eight zero, good departure. Nice to meet you. We'll see you in a bit. Thanks. Two thousand southwest fifty four eighteen. Number five Yankees eleven, Mitch Bush and Tucker, you ready to copy? Oh, five Yankees Zulu, ready to copy. Number five Yankees Zulu on the miss, heading one eight zero. Climb maintain one thousand six hundred. Return to the frequency. Five Yankees Zulu one eight zero at one thousand six hundred. Back to you. Tampa, good morning. This is uh, Cessna 5297 Golf. We're off Sarasota, 800, 1006, 180. We're climbing 1000. Uh. Correction, 900 feet climbing to 2000. Cherokee 104. 4194, Tampa departure, I dent. Climb and maintain 3000. There's your ident. We'll climb to 3000, 104. November 5290 Golf, Tampa departure, I dent. Center 97 Golf, your radar contact, Miles South of Sarasota Airport, say request. 97 Golf, uh, whenever appropriate for you, we can cancel IFR. We just wanted to use this uh, to get out of the area. Center 97 Golf, and you'll want to call and go VFR, you're on at that point. Affirmative, it just did the East Practice here, and then this will burn off. We'll head back in VFR. All right, well, I'm going to keep you on that area for about three or four miles, and then I'll let you go at that point. But if you want to, you want to cancel IFR at this time? Affirmative, sir. Nice, sir. Got your cancellation is received. Just maintain that heading VFR at a blow 3000 and then uh, on course for you. Know, let you go in about two or three miles. It's wonderful. We'll uh, continue up to uh, VFR below uh, 3000 uh, on a heading 18097 go. Okay, you are up, sir. You've got the controls. I've got a little bit of uh, uh, nose up trim. I'll you take are your nose there. Uh, City 418, turn left heading 2. So you got the controls when you're ready. The uh, last assignment, your controls, the last assignment we had was uh, heading 180, climbing to VFR less than 3,000 feet. What if we can make that a 180, sir? And then we'll go out to east and we'll do our maneuvers. Alpha Fox, Try to climb up to these uh, 2,500. Hey, 180 now. Just got to be below four. Five. Everything. Well, let me ask this because typically it's a. Hang on. Five Yankees. So when they talk, just one thing. When they talk, we got to stop so oh. that I can, because uh, IFR is totally different than yeah. VFR. Um, what I was going to say is uh, typically for VFR, it's the odd number. Right, correct. Yeah, yeah, plus 500. But, not, yeah. not so much odd numbers, just plus 500. Plus 500. So I've always said this. So the I've way I remember this is that if you're uh, the people from the east are odd, so, it's, so odd is 500. odd plus 500 or odd whatever. Yeah. If you people from the west, they get even. So that's how I do it for myself. So, gotcha. um, but yeah. So, but, but for our purpose, though, because we're IFR technically, uh, what would that mean? Would we be even? It doesn't matter because the flight plan that. The flight plan that I did was I filed from Sarasota as my departure point. My landing point was Sarasota, and the intermediate point. Okay, nine seven go. We'll uh, squawk via bar, and uh, we'll talk to you a bit. Thanks. Okay. All right, we're good to go. Now it's all you. Let's stay at 2,500 like we did. Why don't you give me a heading at east and take us, and let's have some fun. Established clear for the ILS runway 14 Southwest 14. November 91750. We have the clearance ready to copy. 9175 Zulu, you clear to the Hotel Whiskey Oscar Airport as filed. Actually, the radar vector is the second. Um, Charlie so you had asked me, so I, I did and the. Um, the wreck. On departure, fighting 360, climb maintain 2000. I did the. Uh, uh, the departure. Departure so I found a flight plan, which really was two miles in, in, in essence. Uh, departing from Sarasota, ending Sarasota, going to the VOR. So everything okay. was like this. 
the distance of the headings really didn't matter. Gotcha. I guess technically you could break it down. Uh, I was able to file 3,000 feet because I know that if I went to to uh, four, it's just an extra thought. We didn't need to. Okay. So, but you needed to be above 3,000. And 5, the first six is six, then Charlie Echo X-ray Alpha. So do you want to go up to 35 then, or you want to go... Uh, or you go 25, doesn't matter to me. We do 2,000. Uh, six, Charlie, Echo, okay. X-ray, Alpha, November. Yeah, he canceled us, so we're able to okay. do whatever we want to. He just wanted to be a bar below, uh, back there, but now he can clear us. Seven, five, two, you ready we're to go able down? to do whatever we want to now. Uh, seven, five, two, and we've got visual point, stuff. Just make sure you level up 3,500 feet. Give me a call back with yeah. a six minutes And hopefully this stuff burns off, and I can see okay, Venice. Six, 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 I can see more. Venice down here, so maybe we can work on some touch and goes there. Five, Alpha, Fox, Rutt, and maintain 2,000. Down to 2,000 now, 5 Alpha 5. See, I, I like doing this type of stuff because, and this is not, maybe this could be added out, not to, to um, pat myself on the back or anything, but I don't want to be, I, I don't, I don't want to be deterred by a little bit of low clouds, knowing that you're, you're, you're wasting an entire day by saying, oh, it's cloudy, I don't want to do this, so. Um, so all that to say is that's that's the that situation. That's the beauty of flying, you know, because you fly over weather. Sure. Well, looking at this now, I can tell you that probably going to Arcadia, going to Wachula is going to be something that doesn't work. Yeah. So we're going to have to stay back over here to Venice. So let's not go too Third far to the east. I mean, still within reason. I mean, obviously, you know where we are. Within about 20 miles. Uh, and then we'll we're going to pitch power. So pitch is finding your altitude. Correct. What? One go flight. Okay. And go oh, twenty. Right. Go to twenty one hundred RPM. Peso one golf mic. We don't have. We don't have. We got frugal for the uh, for one four. One golf mic. Roger. Fighting two zero zero. Two zero zero. One golf mic. You hear me? Can you hear myself. Okay. okay. That's right. This thing likes to climb, so I'm going to just let go, see what it does. I'm going to adjust the nose a bit. It's so all my and pitch, yep. Yep. power, is. and trim. The so trim, power is, is trim is the icing on the cake. Icing on the cake. Trimming off the fat. All right. So you may have a little bit too much nose down trim. We'll go fuck. We got I can see the, the feeling in my seat. Yeah, going. I can feel it also. Good. Yeah, let's see where we are. It looks like it's going up a little yeah, bit now, so you can look at this, but don't, don't chase it. Because as you go up, then the speed will drop, and then the nose will come down, yep. see? And then it'll come down, then it will find its way. It's like, oh, hey, man, we, our airspeed got low. It's going to come up, and that modulation will decrease. Don't let it go too much, but say, okay, what's it doing now? Okay. It's going to level off. So you're really close. Within 20 feet, it's pretty, pretty doggone good. Okay. Okay. Right. Eight, five, so go. you got the control, so... Uh, we can do, what, is there anything that we've done up to this point before I just start running through an array of stuff that you want to practice on? Hey, five, Power on stall. <laughs> uh, let's oh, let's yeah, get to that point. So let's do, uh, why don't you do slow flight? We'll just run through everything. So do slow flight, you'll, you'll we'll be as efficient as possible. Slow flight, dirty, which is, is done dirty. Slow flight to a power off stall to a power off stall. Uh, you want to maintain your, just so you know, okay. uh, some of the standards are you want to maintain plus or minus, so you start at 3,500, plus or minus 100 feet, okay, and plus or minus 15 degrees on your, your head. Okay. I'm doing well. Yeah. Well, the, we just started the maneuver, I guess. <laughs> yes, you are doing well. It's like my daughter saying, I've got a straight A, so like uh, quarters one day on, so it's like, yeah. Uh, Oh, I'm sorry, it's 150 feet. Why well, don't you and I just do 100 feet anyway? No, we'll have a different far. standard. So yeah. I'm going to actually uh, power for altitude because I'm Today low. I'm going to be a far, so stand by. I'm at 200 feet low, so I'm going to just creep it up just a tiny bit. Okay. We're at 10 uh, degrees flaps. Right now, 70 uh, knots. And, and honestly, it's okay. You can, with the, whatever altitude you start the maneuver at, meaning when you get at 60 knots, okay? okay? So if it takes you a bit of time to get there, you recognize it. As long as you don't go 100 feet below this or 100 feet higher than that, it's going to be fine. So it's wherever you start is where I, I will hold uh, you to. Let me ask this question, definitely. Approach, are 
Are you on In order to do defined slow flight, do you have to have at least 20 degrees flaps or 10? Or, or You're not doing anything you were told. You're supposed to be 360. So turn left immediately. Turn left immediately. Heading of 020. Maintain 2000. I don't know who that is. No, sir. Zero two zero. Wow, that's not us. So he's no. he's talking to somebody. He's not. I, I yeah. was thinking, like, gosh, he told us he canceled us. So anyway, right, right. Bravo, Tango, Tango, anyway, go. Right, so we don't circuit. have to worry about that. We'll listen, guys. For the longer. Your question was what again? Three Lima Charlie. Oh, turn right heading regards to slow flight. Right heading two. What was about the faster slow flight? Do you uh, have to have them set at any particular? No. Green? Okay. As long as you're within the, the uh, settings, one go, uh, the, the flap, flap limitation speed. 2001 go flying. November 85 Bravo Tango, climb maintain 1 2000, 12000. 1 2000, Bravo Tango. Alpha Fox, I'll have the approach claims for you shortly. Just continue on the approach as the aircraft is departed. Not doing what he was supposed to do off of Venice. Okay, uh, we'll continue on here. Uh, 5 Alpha Fox, thanks. We're late. Uh, He's going to get Lima Charlie, descend and maintain 3000. He's going to get the uh, the infamous, I've got a phone number for you to call. Oh, boy. Damn it, it's Sirius 225 Yankee Zulu. Can we descend? Five Yankee Zulu, negative. Oh, damn. Listen, guys, I know you all want stuff. I will get back to you. Just continue on what you're giving us. I will get back to you. So this gets busy, and so that's when you cancel. It's like we're off their list. We can kind of... Don't let us do whatever so we want. Nine six nine, a kilo tango. What's your okay. Aircraft? So, are you ready to get we're started? Let's get started. started. So, how do you think of tango. this? Oh, I think it's fine. I okay. mean, you can. You ask me. You now, I would put all the flaps nine in. Did you ask me that? I did. Okay. So, I know so, you said. I thought you said it was your any. I didn't know tango. what you were asking. I thought did you have to? Three yes, you can do slow flight at any point for our purposes. I can do that right now. I just hit twenty. Okay. Three flaps. We're at sixty. Established, cleared for the RLS runway. I saw on your thing. We got traffic, but I don't know where they were. Okay. I'll look at my phone and see where the traffic is. You'll be no, nine, nine, correction, one nine or four traffic alert. Traffic off your left side, left a mile maneuvering. Altitude indicates 3,500 type unknown. Hey, we'll be looking for the traffic. Uh, we have him in sight, one nine or four. Five Zulu, five, five Yankee Zulu, turn Where's right heading of zero nine or zero. Five Yankee Zulu, zero nine zero. Where's the guy? November no, five Alpha Foster, you clear oh, for the yeah. RNAV and there's been a airport report your cancellation in the other. Are you hooked up to the uh, uh, no. five. Do you want okay, to? Sure, we can do that. So just go to your Bluetooth. Three Lima Charlie, turn right. I'm looking outside. You're still flying the plane, multitasking, but I'm looking outside. Right, three one zero, three Lima Charlie. No, number one, go. Mike, keep your speed up as best yeah. you can. I'll find. I have multiple aircraft in balance here, so they're now. And one click that connection. You are, so you're good to go. Okay, okay good. So then now you go back to your, and you'll see the ta uh, traffic. Traffic four o'clock. One four, maintain VFR at about two thousand five hundred feet below. We'll expect one four. Which makes sense. 2, They're three thousand. No, our 915 Zulu. Climb and maintain the three thousand. Where on your chart? Oh, he's going north. Over here to. The... I'm looking for my wonderful tower. Although we're way over. We're way above it. Yeah. November five Yankee Zulu. Descend and maintain two thousand. Five Yankee Zulu. The guys off our left hand. Oh, there he is. See him over the left hand side, right up about nine o'clock. Uh, yeah, I see him, yeah. Okay. Okay, so you've done this, so and I think this is going just fine. Procedure. You did okay. well. Your air, your altitude, even from where you started. Perfect. Idea, so way. now let's go into a stall. Let's go to a power off stall. Power off stall. Or approach no, to my contact. Uh, I wish they would consult me before they changed the words of things. 0.1, all right, so I gotta think about this here. I'm at 20 degree flaps. Here's five Yankee Zulu, turn right heading of a one at two zero, intercept the localizer. Now I could. Yankee Zulu, one two zero, intercept the localizer. Now three Lima Charlie, reduce your speed to one two zero, center, not wings level. Ball center, wings level, level, ball center, wings level, ball center, wings level, center, wings level, level ball center, wings level. Oh, Number no. nine kilo tango. Careful, fake runway one four. So when you do it now, don't come to bre up too back abruptly, but not bad. I mean, you see that where the, the initial thing is like, oh, it wants to climb. Yeah. Just make sure you don't get a secondary stall. Secondary stall. Eight five Bravo tango. Okay. Contact okay. climbing center one three really two point three five. Really good. Altitude. The altitude is fine. The um, November seven five Zulu turn. I think fine. Everything was fine. So that was that was a good job. Do you want to do that again, or do you want to do uh, a takeoff? Do a uh, power on stall. The one I got in trouble with last time. Oh, 
mark there. Uh, power on, saw you said? Sure. sure. Okay. All right. So I want to drop down. Why don't you get back to 3,500 feet and we'll push. Okay. Okay. And you're almost there so anyway. So you can go ahead and bring, it, bring the power back, and you know how to set up the maneuver. You get ready to rotate about 55 or 60 knots and give it full power and no, three, turn Charlie, into a rocket ship. Left 270, 3 Lima Charlie. Just want to get to 55 here. Or 9 kilo uh, tango traffic will be following as a citation on a 4.5 mile final descending out of 1,600. Looking for the traffic, 9 kilo tango. I just got pitch up, so I slow my speed down. Well, you know that's not going to necessarily matter looking at because you're going to start to climb. Yeah. Okay. I'm looking at this here. Okay. I want to get as far to 3,500 as I can, but not perfect. Okay, full power, full power. And this is very important for your coordination. Ball center wings level, 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 ball center wings not bad, so silver linings, right? Yeah. So let's go ahead and bring the power back idle. Do the same thing again, that's fine. Four, zero, 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 one, zero, one. So phase one, four, zero, but not bad, three, okay? Nine, okay? Not bad, so the first thing you do is, is first of all, anything, no matter what, you hear the noise go off, whoa, what am I doing wrong? That should be the indication. And even when you move on to commercial, if you ever want to get paid to do anything in aviation, you're going to have to get a uh, commercial license. You just do it to the imminent stall, so it's not full stall. Now, Bravo Victor, your radar contact, three southeast of Sarasota Airport. Bravo Victor. I want everything low. Okay, there you go. And full power. Full power. Don't forget your uh, uh, coordination. Why am I not coordinated? Oh, okay. Step on the ball. Yeah. Step on the ball. Keep it in there. You got to hold it. There you go. Lower the nose. Okay, I don't know why we're turning. Why the hell? Oh, five Yankee Zulu or something like that. You're not coordinated, so let's, let me show you. I got such a hard time doing this. It's not, it's not, it's just, it's easy. I mean, and, and, and easy because you're thinking too much about stuff. Yeah. So we'll start here and just watch what I'm doing, and it's, it's really. approach. Five Yankees. And you're going to have to step on the ball and clear it. That's what I've not been doing. Right, well, you're right. And I think all of our viewers know. <laughs> okay, here we go. Four, four, 55 knots. Here we go. I'm looking down the runway. I'm coming. Here we go. Up. There's a giant tree. I've got to get over this tree. Feel my foot on the... On the uh, it's always in. Look how coordinated we are. So I'm not trying to say that I'm, I'm ready to pray astronaut training. But that's, you see how coordinated we are? We're going to stall. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Nose drops. That's it. We're done. That's all there is to it. And I, I lost coordination towards the end. But we're done. That's it. So all you do is, in any of these stalls, the altitude is fine. If any of these stalls, would it help if I use both hands on the control? I don't know. I, I, I don't not necessarily sure. I mean, the, the hands don't have anything about, to do with your foot. Uh, yeah. So it, basically, in that situation, you want to stay on the coordination. That's the biggest thing. Um, but when you, if you get into a stall, any of the stalls, you hear the noise, undo what you did because you're doing something wrong. That's like somebody like on your shoulder saying, hey, don't be an idiot. I mean, it's like, no. let's do that again. All right, so I'm going to go back to But it's, it's a constant pressure on your right rudder when you get into the stall. Okay. It, I agree, it is an, out, an exterior view. Okay, it's just a VFR maneuver. 32, 35. I just not been uh, stepping on the American. A four sixty-seven tamper approach to Dallas from a uh, one left. One left. Archer buoy two two heavy is passing off uh, fourteen for sixteen. Buoy two two heavy tamper departure. I then maintain one thousand six hundred. Both are autumn. Four sixty-seven tamper with the two two. Buoy two two departure from a uh, one left. One left. There you go. There you go. Hold him wings level. Oh, you, lost, you, yeah, you didn't, you didn't uh, have, uh, let go of this. Where are we doing this with again? Okay. Uh, relax, just relax. Oh, I hate that. Uh, Don't worry about it. You know what, you know what I'm thinking? I'm overthinking it. Overthinking it. Overthinking it. Yo, you are, totally. I, I know that. Yeah, I mean, and I feel like I'm back on the ice back in New England. And <laughs> the, the first thing you do is, is an examiner is not going to want to say, oh, just hands off. I'm gonna, I mean, that's not what they want to do. All you have to do is you are overthinking it because the... the, the, the Maneuver is, is, I'll say, quite simple in that it is, and bring it back to item, we'll go through it again, we'll do, go to it together. So, no transfer of control. 
Cruise speed to 1203, Lima Charlie. All right, so altitude doesn't really matter. We're going to come on back, hold it back, stay with me on this, okay. and, and we'll just have one. Um, so keep keep on. keep one hand on the on the yoke. There you go. We're coming back now. Go full power. Full power. Here we come. We're taking off. Now we're going to feel our foot. Feel my foot on the rudder pedal. Yeah. Okay. Why are we turning that way? Well, because we're we. Uh, I don't know why. Honestly, I don't know why. <laughs> but we need to undo what we're doing. Can you hear me still? I can. Yeah. I can't hear my head. So All right, uh, just call me back when you're. Uh, uh, in about the three All right, maybe too much rudder, but now it's going to stall and lower the nose. That's it. I hate that. I know. I hate this. Is the most. This is the maneuver I hate the most. But it's you know, we have to do it. So it is what it is. Yeah. All right. So that is basically is is do one more here. Do it and just get it done with. That's yeah. that's all. But you notice we're fishtailing. Um. The, the back end was, a four, six, yeah, seven, I mean, a seven, lot eight, of different six, aerodynamic seven. things are happening like because you don't have, really, you're kind of like this thing floating in the air for the most part. So you don't have, you've got a, a propeller that's putting up like a little bit, so you're basically almost suspended. Okay, full throttle. Don't forget the rudder pedal. Okay, see what we're doing right now? We're not, we're, we're, we're full deflection of the rudder pedal. I'm going to turn the rudder pedal is fully deflected. Heavy, climb and maintain 1, 2,000, 12,000, turn right heading at 270. I wish I could figure out the microphone. 270, um, did you see that? What we were doing? Yeah, okay. I'm putting my foot on the uh, rudder pedal. I wasn't doing that before. Okay. Okay. 2472, descend and maintain 2,000. 2,000, back on 2472. Okay, rudder pedal. Lower the nose. Holy cow! Woo! Baby. Okay, you're done. I'm done. See, that's all there's to it. We're not doing that this anymore. This is driving me. This is driving me nuts. Where'd you get that from? Uh, your headset, Sporties? No, I bought it at. Uh, I mean, it's, in, it's not the headset. I, I don't know what it is. It's this this plane. I've never had an issue with a headset before. It's intermittent. I, I believe it's the audio okay, of four, the. Uh, we're heading south now. Final one okay, that's fine. Five. So, how do you final feel? Five. That's all it was. You yeah. see how you did it? That yeah. was the first time you did it by yourself with no issues. Yeah. Okay. Talk so. Why you done it before? But I'll have you at the star horn. Okay. So. I think I think you did did good on that. You want to do it again, or you want to? No, we put a pin in it. Just like just like golf, baby. I support that. So let's go let's go to 3,500 feet and let's do some steep turns. You can do heading the south if you want. Let's just check airspace is where we are. What are we near? Not much. Ayaka City. Are we really? Oh, we're, we're, we're south. Uh, it's still East Brax area. Okay. I'm going to check the weather of Sarasota. Or at least with that mouse. 322 Heavy, when able, direct to Mommy. 322, direct Mommy at the time. So when you're ready... Tampa Departure, Cherokee 3644 Romeo with you, 1,000 feet off Sarasota. 3644 Romeo, Tampa Departure, ident. I am not hooked up. This is the ident, 44 Romeo. Are four you four okay Romeo, for steep turns? Contact, climb, maintain yep. 5,000. Climb, maintain 5,000, 44 Romeo. Back on 42472, contact Sarasota, Tower 120.1. Tower Tower, back on 2472. Trying to connect to us. There we are, so I should be able to get my the weather. So when we work towards this, we can go do touch and go. Okay, so Venice is still IFR. I don't know about Seabrain. Seabrain? Way out there, huh? That's still IFR as well. Yeah. I think uh, today unusual because Central Florida has is much yeah, but this more fog. Two two five Yankee Zulu with you. Well, let's keep flying. We'll be out here and do some more stuff. I just check and see what Sarasota. It was Sarasota was burning Yankee off. Have a departure. I didn't call. Maintain three thousand. An hour ago, I should come back with a new one here in a minute. So we'll just keep. We'll do, we'll do some steep turns. Okay. So when you're ready, pick an altitude. If, if it's going to be thirty-five hundred. Uh, okay. Feet. Double direction, and we'll do uh, steep turns to the which which uh, left or right. You tell me. Which one do you want? Flyer's choice or pilot's choice. Um, oh, you do if I didn't do it, you're right. Uh, okay, do do left first. All right. Tampa, a good Enter. morning. TBM nine three zero Lima. X ray is uh, seven point nine for five thousand. Crossing restriction uh, twenty miles southeast of Sarasota. 
Lima, X-ray Look outside, you got a great uh, sign. We're in a bowl, right? Hey, sir, and uh, we already have information echo. We would like the uh, on aft to runway 14, if we may. All right. Temperature yeah, departure, King Air 120 and over Charlie. Uh, what we'll is the side picture of a plane? 3,000 runway heading. Uh, We're dropping, descending, we're descending. Okay. Departure, high dent, follow, maintain 12,000, 12,000. High dent, 12,000, zero over Charlie. That's a perfect bank angle there. Keep it going all the way. Well, 20 degrees four, prior to the bank angle. There you go. Roll out. Zero, four, zero. Good job. So you did okay through that. Buoy 22 heavy contact Jacksonville center one three five point seven. It sounds normal in your head. One three five seven five buoy two two. Good day. Zero November Charlie radar contact four southeast of the uh, Sarasota airport. Zero November Charlie. You still me here? I, mean, I, I, I can hear you perfectly. Ah, it drives me. Nuts. It's it's. I've always struggled with the bottom of it's the bottom jack here. Could be a dirty connection. I'm not sure. I could maybe clean the the thing. Water in the air, maybe. <laughs> okay, so that was good. So you could do that again. The only thing you want to learn is you got to look outside. Yeah. And then so 75 outside, 25 inside. You look outside. So gosh, the and, and there's audible cues. The the uh, increased RPM. You'll hear it. You know, you'll feel yourself sinking in the seat. To also look outside and say, Wow, it looks like I'm going down. A perfect spiral there. You did good. Uh, so why don't you do it to the left again? So you want 45 degrees right in the middle of those. Yeah. November. Okay, let's go. King or zero November Charlie leaving 4,000 turn right heading at 310. As you enter leaving the turn, 4, pull back. Zero, zero just to Charlie. see you want the, the cowling to go right around the rim of the bowl. Approach 499. More of a bank Tango angle. Direct Sarasota at 4,000. Halfway, uh, more, 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 that's good, now stop, now pull back, right, you're going to have to pull back in the back pressure, because it looks like we're going down, and we can look inside and say, yeah, where we are, now down. you feel the G's you're feeling, yeah. okay, not bad, okay, you're still within limits, okay. but we, it's too close to limits, so you want yeah. to be a lot less than that, but not bad, okay, but the bottom line is, so, it's as you do a steep turn, is to recognize the audible uh, uh, and the visual five, sounds yeah, of what's going on, one, and then four, zero, back up both of those five, up with, one, with the zero. instruments. Like, well, wow, I'm going down a thousand feet a minute. Yeah. Well, okay. All right, so yeah, let's do that again, and then this time try it to where you go. First of all, you want the middle of those d dashes. That's 45 right. degrees. Go or all the way to the left, and then go right to the right. Okay. Okay. So we'll start here. And Tampa, 997 Romeo Sierra is with you, 1.1 for 3,000. You're starting a little bit slow, so it's going to be a disaster. So what you want to do is you want to be into 2,100 RPM, but you're, you're, see how we're starting? So you're going to roll in, and it's you're, you're starting at a deficit. So you want to be at about 90 knots when you start? That makes sense to you? Yeah, it does. Okay, so get to 3,500 feet, and let's, let's, I don't want to set you up to fail, so that's one thing I saw. So you, if you're starting really slow, it, gonna it's, it's going to be a mess. Yeah. Okay. So 2100 RPM should be fine. Get 3500 uh, feet. Get yourself savage. About 95 knots feet. is good. Hey, we may be able to go to watch you. Are you okay with that? Yeah. If we can. I mean, we can. I don't know how far we are from it. But. Five Yankees, Zulu, see Derek Punta Gorda. Five Yankees, okay, Zulu, Derek Punta yep. Gorda. I'm ready for you. Hey. Okay, good job. Seven Romeo, Sierra, climb, maintain one, zero thousand, ten thousand. Really good job. Now you see, look outside the picture. It looks like we're going down, right? We are. Yeah, yeah, pull back. You said maintain three thousand for TVM nine three zero, Lima X-ray. And you zero, we'll do more. Miami Center on one, three, two, there you go, five, good. So See how that goes? Five. That's a perfect steep turn, Bill. And we're coming up on our uh, heading, heading up right east, now. 20 degrees prior. You're going to yeah, roll out. Roll. Don't lose it, though. you got to look outside. Don't stare at the in instruments. Now look to the right. We're clear on the right. Go ahead and roll tango, right to the next. Go heading up right. three, uh, four, zero. Three, four, zero. But not too high now. So you got to still look outside. Okay. Because you know how your airspeed, because you're not looking outside, we're way high, we're going to get into a stall. See you know what I'm saying? So that's why yeah. it's important. We have your bank, right, well, bank angle. It's just knowing what's going on and where you're looking is the, is the thing.
Not that bad. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. What, uh, uh, the issue was the... Uh, Romeo, sir, have a great day. That's not, uh, that's not that bad. Uh, let me see. That, that better. That's not that bad. What you want to do is, though, speed, though. your airspeed was really low. Yeah. So when you start, I don't know if you saw or not, when you started, you were kind of in a nose-high attitude. Yeah. And let's take us to, I'm thinking, it looks open over here to, to, to Wachula. I think I see the airport at 12 o'clock. So let's go to Wachula. On Alpha Tango, it's fighting a 330. It's going to be about a heading of, let's go to 350. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. I'm looking someplace different. Where's Arc Arcadia? Is, can't be. Maybe Arcadia is clear. Hang on a second. I'm just going to shoot in the sky here to see if we can get something. TVM Zero Lane, actually, uh, what's your flight conditions? Sarasota says that the uh, uh, VFR now. Uh, do you have the airport inside by a chance? Uh, sir, we have an idea where the airport is uh, on this side, a little bit to the east. Uh, it's 100% uh, under capture. Okay, I'm sorry. Just what I was talking about, you can do a D. Yeah, and as then you take CHF. a look towards the plane, I was telling you that, or, yeah, or you, you knew that? Start right, to I did see that. It. Yeah. Um, yep, anyway, so right, right now, right now is off our. Uh, so I think as I'm looking at this, or if you look at a heading of 300, roughly 350, uh, it's over this way. Yes. So let's go to Wachula. We're nine miles from Wachula. And it's a heading of E, heading of about 115. So that's going to be straight this way. And it may be in the clouds. I don't know. We'll just see where we are. We're heading right now for Wachula. So we're heading. Uh, oh, you can go to Wachula first. Let's do that. That's fine. Go to Wachula first. What's your heading there? Not Wachula. Uh, yeah, go to Wachula first and see. Yeah, it may be open right over here. And if not, it just depends here. Heading is 030. It just really depends. We're 20 miles away. We're just kind of winging this here today for all of our viewers. <laughs> just you and me. Yeah, I know. Yeah, <laughs> 5102, 1300. Like I'm talking, I'm like I'm out of good sports center. Hey, Mom. 5102, time for departure, I didn't. Okay, 15 miles heading. It may be IFR, Phil, but we'll see where we are. It looks IFR. Right turn to circus at 3,000. Let me check the weather on my phone. Have you checked weather on this before? Uh, yes. Okay. Look at Wachula here. Look at weather. Wachula should not show anything for Wachula. Oh. Bartos Fog, Lakeland's VFR. Lakeland's fairly close to Wachula. So, two we just expect the Alice to run my one four. Uh, we okay, can we, keep we on going to the see what's up there. I don't think much. Yeah. I think Where the, are we at? We're the, 15 I, miles. I think the fog was heavier north of Tampa and east. I'm to wonder if I could see. See, I can't see Arcadia. But I think Wachula, though, is right. I mean, it can't be too far away. This is going to burn off. Let's proceed to Wachula. Yeah, yeah. Max, sure turn left, if it's, it's bad, good. we'll, uh, we'll yeah, head to Venice. Keep the Emily Max, sure, sir. Venice is still showing IFR. Yeah. Sarasota, they said, is VFR. So somebody's lying because it's not VFR. I mean, it'll burn off quick. Want to do some more steep turns? You want to go do touching? Uh, All right, well, now we got to find an airport. airport. So I'm looking at if we did Wachula or say, uh, Arcadia is uh, roughly 120. Approach on a one this had I'm confident that that is going to be zero, one two seven zero five. Now we got what heading to Wachula. Wachula is going to be. Uh, about zero three zero from where we are. I think it's going to be open right over here. I think we'll be okay. TBM is zero. Lima X-ray turn left heading on one seven zero. You're four miles from fire approach six maintain two thousand. So you're established on the local log. Cleared, uh, and then to your establish on fire approach, close for there on ever on my one four. Well, thank you, sir. And a left turn one seven zero. I mean, if the ceiling is a thousand feet, we'll be okay. Zero, Venice, or right, let's go to Lakeland. Five off in November. We've been getting in all morning. I was going to ask you something Five yesterday on the VOR. VOR. 
Which I'm assuming you're, we're using. No, we're using no. GPS. Okay. GPS. So no, only certain places have VORs. So Lakeland, I believe, is 116.0. I can check on my phone. Oh, you can check. Show me. Uh, make it small. And look for Lakeland, LAL. So you can drive up here. I'm trying to read LAL. Lakeland. Okay. So next to that, you're going to see. So that's the VOR tech. 116.0. So this is a good lesson. TDK airport radar Type in 116.0. On departure, fly around my heading, climb and maintain. 1.6. 2000, expect zero. fly level 360 within a one zero minute okay, okay. departure. Switch. Departure control frequency. So if I were to tell, hey, Phil, take me direct to Lakeland, how would you get there? I have no idea. Okay, all right. Well, we, lear we learned this. It was a review. Well, so first thing, so let's say it looks like... Oh, well, well, the, the, the reason I'm asking, uh, Lakeland, is that a VOR? Yeah, it says Vortex. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 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 So, so it's not the... Uh, uh, so, so then what you do is here, so you've got it tuned in here. This is a number to maintain 500 feet above 12,000 for 8,000 by 15,000 hour. Is it 4,000 feet? Where's the... i got to look at the picture of him. Where is he? Yes, sir. Two zero decimal one for Lima Ashley. Two Lima Lima, descend to maintain two thousand. Oh, it's not anywhere. Five Alpha Fox, our read back is correct. Four Alpha Lima, number one, ready right right for departure. Yeah, this is all going to burn off. Anyway, so let's go. Let's get back to this. Two one six three, time for approach. Okay. So what you're going to do here is. Make sure this says nav. Okay, so GPS is working on this. Nav is working on this. Nav. Okay. All right. So that now it's like, hey, you're picking up Lakeland. One six point three. Now turn it until it says two. That's from. So keep turning. You turn it in a complete circle, and eventually come around to two. Keep going. And then. There we go. Two is there. Keep going. Keep going. Center the needle. I don't want to do it too fast. You're right. That's a good point. Two thousand. Two thousand. Chip one sixty three. Okay, so make it the needle center. Now how come it says GS? That's glide slope, that's for an ILS. Oh, okay. All right. So now, for you to get to Lakeland using the VOR, you're going to fly heading 350. Okay. Does that make sense no, to you? No, yes. And if you look at where we are right now, does that match on your map? Yes. We're here. Lakeland's there. You're going to fly 350, and that's how you get to Lakeland. Okay. We're not going to, we're not going to Lakeland, but that's how you use FDOR. All right. So let's go back to uh, Wachula. It's telling us that we should fly heading of... Uh, three zero zero to get there. Five Alpha November to send maintain six thousand. Contact Tampa final one eight point five. To watch. Yeah, I think I see it here. Right. Look left. I see it here. You see it? I see it. Do you? It's um, it, we're rolling right on. So it, it's. Could be directly in front of us. No, right? directly. We're now we're rolling right on on a high final. Okay. You see it? I don't. Okay. Right off the nose. So we're not on the tangle fighting a three zero. Straight down. See where the clouds zero start? Zero. To the buildings. <laughs> I just see everything seems the same. So go from the compass straight up with a row of clouds straight. There's three, two buildings right in front of us right here. We're on final right now. Yes. You see it? I don't, I don't see it. I see it no on worries. the map. So see this road? Yes. Follow the road up here, okay. then go left and go straight. You'll see two white buildings. Okay. And a oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. So I think we can make it. I mean, I, I don't want to... There's clouds over there, so if we take off, it's like... You can expect the building. I don't. I mean, it's going to burn off. I'm just trying to see how low the clouds are. It's a scattered layer, so it's technically not. You have to maintain the cloud clearances. Um, I don't feel comfortable doing That's fine. Good, 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 good. I'm glad you said that. Um, let me see where else we can go. 120.1. Lakeland's VOR. Lake, uh, I mean, we can land, but the problem is... No, I got you. And it's going to burn off. I mean, yeah. it will burn off. It'll burn off, but... No telling how many people are on the pattern. 253, turn setting up 250. 250 heading to 163. Where else can we go? We can try to go down there. Do you want to try to go to Arcadia? I think it's the same, John. Okay. To be honest with you. 
I, I checked the uh, weather this morning, and it, it said it was unusual for clouds to, or not clouds, fog for that much. Okay. To be uh, more centralized today. No worries. I mean, I'm, I'm fine with that. I mean, so is there anything else you want to work on out here then? I mean, as far as touch and goes go, this is our best shot. Uh, we are at... Let's do this real quick. Let's. I don't want to put you in. I'm not going to force you. Yeah. If you from a comfort level, if we can get down and the clouds are at a thousand feet or 1,100 feet, whatever, we are at our traffic pattern. Now, oh, yeah. I do believe traffic pattern here is 800 feet, so we could be okay. We, we could do it. Um, let me just check. I'm going to read the AFD here real quick, so I am not giving you bad information. I'm just saying I wouldn't feel comfortable if I was doing it myself. Oh, okay. No, I don't. I, I don't want to do anything that you don't yeah. feel comfortable with at all. So that, if that's. I, if I was here by myself, I wouldn't be up here. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. Okay. <laughs> Unless it was uh, via phone. Alpha, you'll be following Airbus. Currently, it's at 12 o'clock and eight miles on the base at 2,000 feet. Uh, we'll be turning them down here shortly. Yeah, we have the Airbus. In Traffic front pattern now. used to be uh, 800 Roger, feet. Follow the Airbus. You clear for the visual approach to runway uh, one four. That's back seven. in the way olden days. This is the visual one four following Airbus now. Finger. Now it's still thousand five. Typical one sixty three. Uh, I'll have to turn to the, on the localizer here momentarily unless you pick up the airport. Okay. Yeah, it's not. Uh, uh, okay. If, uh, we might be able to pick it up. Sorry, just to expect the Alice. That's fine. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, so I think we're going to be okay here. I'm not really too concerned about this. Um, no. Oh, good for you. Good. Okay. No one's in the pattern. No one's on the ground. I didn't observe your radar contact. I can't believe that diamond is still down there. I'm going to switch over to the uh, frequency. Yeah, go ahead. One, yeah. two, 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 this is going to burn up. I bet you. Yeah, I think it's good now. It's burning. Yeah, up. It, it's, it's, it's going to burn off. The temperature's going to rise. It's going to go away. So it's good that we're here. We can work on landings and not scrap. And then by the time we get back, you can even see there. So it's clearing up too. So yeah. we'll be good to go. Okay. So you can make your radio calls if you want. I mean, you're 2,500 feet. You can just. I would honestly spiral over the field and then make a left downwind. Watch all the traffic, 5297 Golf. We are flying over the field at uh, 2,500, and we will make a left turn into the downwind. Watch your left. For one way, three, six. And, oh. and, and look over your shoulder, see if the wind favors that. The wind may be calm and it may be a limp. Wind looks like it's blowing in, in front of us. From the north? From the north. Okay, so then we will do three, six. So yeah, just do a couple turns, or, or if you want to. I guess you're at 1,500 now, so. Uh, it looks like I'm. Um, Looking over the segmented circle here. Okay. Looks like there's a crosswind from the left. From the west? The right, from the west. This way? From the east? It's, it's or the, blowing from this way. Blowing from, from the west okay. to the east. Okay. So I'm going to do you this. You still think 3 6 is the best runway? I can't see. I don't know. You might fly over? Yeah, go. Did you make your left downwind and just it, we'll say it is and we'll fly and I'll have a good view of it as we come by. Watch the traffic, 5297 Golf, making a left base turn. Runway 36, watch you left. Coordination when oh. you're slow and low to the ground is super important. Make sure you're coordinated. Why is this not? Because you're stepping on the wrong ball. You're stepping on the wrong rudder pedal when you I turn. I want to step on the left ball. I mean, right ball. Right ball when you turn, right yeah. Ball. Yeah. Getting a little slow here, too, on down one. Okay, so go ahead and get us, uh, just relax. Go, yeah. You got 1,000 feet, go to 2,000 RPM. 2,000 RPM? Yeah, yeah, you're okay to keep descending. Oh. You're, you're 1,200 feet's fine. You're, okay. Normally it's 1,100 feet. So you bring the power back and then and get on your downwind. But let me ask you real quick. What, what did, uh, we may be confused as to what we're doing. What, what is your understanding of what we're doing? Oh, wait a minute. I see some uh, some people on the runway there. They can't fly there. Where are you looking? What people on the runway? Right on the side there. Oh, they're fine. Just make a no, radio. No, no, no. I mean, trucks. Yeah, they're fine. They're lawnmowers. Yeah. 
Where they're like, they're, they'll move. I mean, have we made a radio call? No. <laughs> okay. Watch your traffic. This is Cessna 97 Gulf. I'd like to do some touch and goes. A whiskey Delta departing the area to the south of Mockley traffic. Yeah, they're they're off the runway. You're fine. I would just go ahead and do it, and if it's an issue, we'll go around. I'm not too worried about it. Why don't we, um, where are we at here? Watch your traffic. I uh, see uh, some vehicles on the side of the runway. Uh, you monitoring radio? Okay, go ahead and just turn final, or phase to final. Okay, so don't forget all of you fly the plane first and look at our rudder pedal. Okay, so all that really means is while you're doing it correctly, you don't need as much rudder pedal when you're turning. I wasn't even using the uh, right pedal. Okay. I was using so the right pedal for some reason. So let's go ahead and get, try to get ready to land here. We're kind of in a, in a uh, mess here. Okay. So, okay. So a couple things that's going on for us right now, just so you understand. Okay. Just relax. So what's happening right now? is we're cross-controlled, we're near our stall, and we're low to the ground. Yeah. So that's what we don't want to have happen. No. Okay, so bring your throttled idle. Bring the flaps out. Flaps out, out help please. Here. Thank you. See them right now? I, no, I see them down there. I just don't know what they're doing and why they're there. Doing. Let's, just, let's just do a low approach. Let's go down to about 500 feet and see what they're doing. They're not, yeah. not answering. Pardon me? They're not answering. Hey, watch Hula traffic. This is 97 Gulf. We're going to do a low approach over runway 36. Watch Hula. They're cutting grass, doing something. They've been at that one spot. It's nowhere in the world I would land that. Oh, and you're right, because you could, I mean, you, you're still safe. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, you are, because they're not on the runway, and your wings don't hang over the runway. Yeah, but you don't want to be anywhere and near they're the moving, runway. And they're they're moving now. That's a good lesson right now. I keep Look at the wing with the wind real quick. Wind sock. I don't see it where Okay, it is a left. It's out of the out of the way. Watchula traffic, five two nine seven go, making left crosswind, runway three six. Watchula, full power. Okay, a couple of things here. Just relax a little bit. We, we've got to. We're we're getting kind of balled up here. Okay. Yeah. So what's happening is we were low. Yeah. Low. 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 Okay. It will bring that up. But we are also cross controlled in, in that type of situation. I need some help with that then. Okay. Cross so basically, is do the opposite of uh, step on that ball. So if I'm if the ball is right, I need to step on the right. Yes. Yes. Always. So then, okay. right now, I feel you got a lot of right rudder, and which is perfect. It's where it needs to be. Okay. That's the only thing. That's where you'll get yourself into trouble. So now we see where we are. We're going to climb up to a thousand feet, not too abruptly though. Okay. With seven seventy five, you want day seventy five mm -hmm. is okay for climb out. 75. You 70. see this ro the road up here, make your left hand turn. Call your base yeah. turn, or downwind. Watch your the watch traffic, 5297 Golf, making left base, runway 36, watch your left. Left downwind. Left, left downwind, watch your left. And what am I doing now? Well, okay. a lot of things that's happening right now, so we, we just need to relax, okay, because uh, we're getting ourselves into a, a negative situation. Yeah. Because we are climbing, we're slow and we're uncoordinated. Okay. So that's what we've got to... I feel uncoordinated. Okay, so just relax. Okay. I think you're, you're, you're in your mind, you're nervous about the plane, the people on the runway, so you're, you're thinking about that, yeah. is what I see, because it's, it, they're not an issue. We don't have to land. We can certainly go around, and it's a great exercise in going around. And they may be down there, government employees working, who knows? I mean, I know that's kind of an oxymoron, but get, get down to uh, 1,100 feet, go to your 2,000 RPM. Let's not forget the basics of where we are. 
Okay, so you're going to get on your heading. Roughly, it should be heading at 180 ballpark. Good job. Check Venice here. What do you want to do now? I'll make your bait. Pretend you're going to go there. This will come back in about 20. Watch the traffic, 5297 Golf, making left base, runway 36121. Okay, Sarasota's BFR. Now, I'm curious because I need, I def, what? I definitely need help with this turn coordination thing, maybe okay. even on the ground. Well, ground, you're not going to be able to know it on the ground. Well, I'm going to tell you all day long on the ground. So what all it is right now is when you turn, it is you turn to the left, yeah. you need less Everything's going to be right rudder, okay? You just need less of it, okay? So when you're turning left, your tendency is to turn left and step on the ball. So watch this. I'm going to take the controls. Watch. I, I turn left, and you step on the ball. Looks what happens. But let's do this. So no, no, no ball, nothing. So we're flying along. And if I turn to the left, okay. I need a lot less rudder. So you don't step on the ball. I don't want to say don't. But look at how much more coordinated we are. Yep. The right turn, you got to step on the ball, and you just modulate really your right rudder in the turns is all it is. So step on the ball. That's all. That's all you have to do is just step on the ball. Okay. I, I know a lot of times this could be like a linear approach. It's got to be this, this, this. Well, you know this. what I'm looking at also, John, is the wing tilting. That that's going to look. It tilts like this, but it's what? very, very. It goes all the way. I but mean, sometimes it, when I'm not even turning right, the wings will be. Uh, sure, normal, turbulence. I mean, it can be a lot of different things okay. like that. I mean, it's, so it's it's it, the instruments are not um, for VFR Precise. purposes. Yeah, it doesn't. Okay. All right. So I'm going to make a left hand turn. Look, no rudder rudder inputs. Look how coordinated we are. Yeah. But if you do it and you say, "Oh, I'm turning left. I got to step on my left rudder," you're going to be in a disaster. Yeah. See what I'm saying? So that's yeah. all. It's really just step on the ball. So you you look and say, "Huh? Am I coordinated?" Well, oh, look, I, my feet are off the rudder. I do a little bit of right rudder as I turn to the the left. That's going to be my. Uh, my success with landing, because I, I know for certain when I land, I totally forget rudder pedals. Okay. Because almost every time I'm to the left of the runway landing. Okay. Well, good. Dance with your feet. That's why you'll hear me say dance with the feet. You dance. Keep it dance. Keep it moving. Let's see what these jokers are doing, and we may not be able to land here. I mean, it's, it's VFR in Sarasota. They wouldn't. They, they're going to struggle. Touch and go. Alpha is three miles to the north, coming 45. Still going to move. Well, they did move. I don't know what they're doing. I think they're just cutting grass. Watch the traffic. This is a 97 Gulf. Is uh... oh, short final runway 36. What you love? Where we are here. Was my comfort. Yeah, no, I agree with you. It's like a party there, you know, like <laughs> so much for the hangar. Yeah, let's just get out of here. They're going. Okay, you got the controls. I can drive back at 2,500 feet. Closing left downwind. And pause right and clap. I'm bringing the clap. Wow. Coordinated. Uh, we can do a couple things. We want to try to go to, to Arcadia, or I mean, if you say, "Hey, listen, we've done enough today. We want to go back home." I mean, it's up to you. Venice is VFR now. And yeah, we can go back to, uh, go to Sarasota. Venice? Sarasota. You want to be done? Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, anything? So tell me what you're thinking. What? What? Uh, I, I'm more concentrated on wanting to uh, land, practice touch and goes, or even full stop landings. Well, no. So Venice is open. Do you want to go do some landings? Yeah, we could do that. I, I'm not trying to push you. If you if you are tired and you want to go back home, we can go home. Uh, it's not not an issue to me one way or the other. Venice is now VFR. Sarasota is now VFR. 
Oh, we can go to land in Venice. Uh, uh, why don't we do this? Uh, land in Venice, a couple of them, and then uh, go back to okay. zero, so we All land right. on uh, probably zero four. Okay, let's All go right. give it a whirl. Take us to Venice. All righty. So direct to, is it B-I-N, B-N-C? B-N-C. It should be K-B-N-C. Nope. Oh, it does automatically that for you. Automatically. Okay. So. All right. So you can go 2,500 feet. 2,500 feet. Make a left turn. Okay, but you're making a left turn. Now remember, you take your foot off the rudder pedal. Now make your left turn. It's going up, so I want left. Yeah, right, correct, right, but you've got to, while that's in theory is correct, you've got to make sure that the instruments are telling you the right thing. Okay. And that will that will pay a, a, a tremendous dividend to you. A little bit slow here now as we're climbing. Um, so you can move. A tremendous dividend when you fly instruments is that your body's going to be telling you certain things. Well, Phil, you're, although the instruments say you're in straight and level flight, you're in a left turn. That's called vertigo or okay. spatial disorientation. And there's a lot of things. Like, that's why in the clouds you don't turn your your um, strobe lights on. You'll feel like you're in a 70s disco party, and you're like, oh, you, know, you can't, and it's it's very uh, distracting. Okay. Yeah, all that stuff burned off. You can see air soda. You can see a lot here. And I still think... I don't know where Wachula is. Let me just take our Sarasota is. Let's take her out. Maybe, uh, since we're out here, Arcadia may be better. I think we'll fly right over Arcadia, matter of fact. 20 miles. How far away from here, please? Actually, I'm still trying to figure 41 this 41 miles. And where are you reading 41 miles? Oh, 41 uh, distance. Okay, gotcha. So fly this heading and see if we can't get to, to uh, Arcadia. And if it looks not, like I need to head east. Actually, uh, it'd be west. To where? Venice? To, to Venice. Okay. Let's get our altitude. I dropped out at 2,500. Okay, 2,500 is perfect. So halfway between here and Venice, we're going to see Arcadia on our left-hand side. All right? Okay. So... What I'm trying to do right now, just so that you know, we're here. I want to go okay. to the, I would assume, the right. It's, this is a mirrored image. Uh, it's what, well, exactly what you're doing, sure. Yeah. So what's left is right, what I'm looking at. So I'm going to turn right. Well, that's correct, but that's not a navigate. I mean, you're well, not. Well, it's not navigate. You know, I'm. I'm just winging it, John. Because here's a question I had. Um, since we really can't use four flight, so it's going to tell you. So see, it does not. It doesn't tell you the heading to fly. You're no, guessing exactly. So I'm just following the uh, pink line there. Right. So that's not how you're so, supposed so to do. So the question it. I would have then, since I'm. I'm assuming uh, Venice doesn't have a VOR. It does not, but it is a it is a fix. Okay. So why don't you go direct to KVNC on this? So direct. The direct, and then turn this. Uh huh. Why is that? Okay. KVNC. AV. Oh. B. Bucket answer. 
traffic. Helicopter 1 to 3, Mike Papa, yeah. we're 5 to the northwest. We're going to overfly your field, 700 feet, fucking have traffic. See. Okay, and then push. Nope. Hit enter. Enter. And then enter. Enter again. Okay, now you're going direct, so it's telling you what heading to fly. It wants you to fly heading to about 240. 24. Four. So I, I just went between okay, 240. Two, two, four, zero. Four, zero. Okay. So you set your thing up here. Fighting 240. And you are going to see Arcadia up here on your left hand side, which is hazy, so you're probably better off going to Venice and VFR. There's few, they said few clouds at. Uh, like and what runway is open? Because I know there's I'll tell you the right traffic You just on. fly the plane. Get us to 2,500 feet. We uh, lost some altitude. Wind's calm. So I don't know what they use. Uh, get the TAF there. I'm not sure we can listen. Remark. Venice Municipal Airport. Automated weather observation 1552 Zulu. Wind calm. Visibility 8. Sky condition clear below 1 2000. Temperature 2 2 Celsius. Dew point 2 2 Celsius. Altimeter 3 0 1 4 inches of mercury. Remarks. Venice Municipal Airport. Automated weather observation 1552 Zulu. Wind calm. Visibility 8. Sky condition clear below 1 2000. Temperature 2 2 Celsius. Dew point 2 2 Celsius. Altimeter 3 0 1 4 inches of mercury. Okay, so we Remark. got that. One two two seven two. Okay, so we got the Unicom up. Maybe people flying in the field, maybe not. Most people cancel when it's a little cloud, so it may be a pretty quiet day there. So you're thirty miles away. Okay. At thirty eight miles, nautical miles here. Yeah. And Venice traffic. 30, okay, 30 point nine miles. Number two six two Bravo Whiskey turning final for one three Venice full stop. That comes off by eight. I don't have any idea why. I think this is more accurate because it's part oh, yeah. of the plane. So pitch power trim, 2,500 yeah. or uh, 2,500 feet. Five feet. So let me ask you this: So we're we're kind of mirroring the end, so to speak, of the uh, the flight today. How do you think? I'm feeling better. Uh, radio communication, I'm I, I improving and feel good about that. The uh, stalls. Feel a lot better with that. Okay, traffic check. Um, you doing my down one wrong? Yeah, everything's a work in progress. I don't feel like I've mastered and you know, I can forget about it. I think every time I practice it, I'll, I'll do better. I agree. Uh, what I want to work on is the turn coordinator. Okay. Um, I think, especially in landing, I have a problem where I may just uh, blank out, where I'm not using my rudder or my ailerons. I'm just kind of winging it. Okay. Um, I have a tendency of moving to the left of the runway. And I like what you said, you know, we 
use the whole runway since we paid for it. And I don't think a lot has to do with the wind okay. or crosswind at all. I think it's it's me. I mean, cause every every landing, every 189 landing, I've done the same thing. Just yeah, the goal is to keep the runway center line between your legs. Do whatever it takes to make that happen. And a lot is going to be dancing with the feet. Keep your feet moving. And a lot of it is. Um, not so much coordination, it's multitasking. Sure. It, it's, it's my uh, kryptonite. Sure, because a lot of times what I'll say is this, and I see this in you and a lot of students, myself even, you get myopic or you get very, uh, clo not close-minded, but you get um, the blinders on, you're fixated. You focus on one thing, my airspeed or my altitude, and then you're maintaining your altitude, but you're at 60 knots. Yeah. Or your your uh, my turn coordinator, but then you're, you're I mean, so it just is everything. And then so much at the VFR level, you uh, or the private pilot level, you want to look outside. That's all your visual is outside. This is uh, two thirty eight. Okay. So we also are. Maybe um, about two two zero. Okay. So we processed a little bit. Okay. Traffic. area traffic. Cessna seven one one Alpha departing to the east. Area. Boy, I used to fly into Volcaria all the time. <laughs> Over there north of uh, north of uh, Vero Beach. Traffic 9 o'clock, 800 feet below. Okay, it's over here to your left hand side. Hey, look at the map and see where that may be. Okay, traffic starts here, it's also a big fun and runway 3 2. Right there, right. Off our, uh, there he is. See him go over that left hand shoulder? Right crossing the road now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tiny. Like an old mosquito. Yeah. Traffic. We're way up there, 22 uh, not miles away. It's a long way. I mean, we're going from the, the practice area, I mean, the full range of our area. So we were a ways away. And still at 38? No, that's going to be from what you from point A to point B. So you're, you're 21 miles now. You've gone halfway. So the AWAS is uh, your weather. 
checking. Yes, we've done that already. Winds are calm, the sky is clear. Visibility is eight miles. And uh, altimeter is 3014. Okay. Two zero one four. Yep. It looks like the airport's that right over here. Guessing, I'm like two four zero. Maybe I'm wrong. What is that over there? Uh, I'm clear, Donna. Where is Sarasota? Thank you. Sarasota's up there. Yeah, that's gotta yeah. be Venice right over here. I would say right in the middle. Yeah, right off the nose, I believe is Venice. Traffic, traffic 12 o'clock is Venice. Miles to see 4,000 feet above runway 23. Venice. They're landing runway 23. 2-3. Two, straight ahead, right? Our heading is 2-4-0. Okay, yep. so. Can we make a straight approach or do no. we? No. Do we never, you never do that in an uncontrolled field. Um, and it's just it's a bad habit just because if you did that, like it's been done to us multiple times, but we got to do the right thing. Okay. So at least five miles in, I'll make our announcement. I would do 10 miles and just 10 say, miles. hey, I'm 10 miles to the, to the miles east. To east. Uh, Going to overfly the field 1,500 feet, enter uh, left traffic for runway 23. I keep listening. Part by Keep listening for... Um, uh, keep listening for traffic and where they're landing and flying. Sounds like they are using 2-3. How do you feel, okay? Yep. Good. You tired? You feel uh, okay? I'm, I'm feeling all right. You know, okay. it, I have a much uh, better appreciation for pilots who fly this all day. You fly this type of plane or fly Anything. in general? Yeah, yeah. Driving a truck, flying a plane, <laughs> driving a car. And Venice traffic, Cherokee 4315 Tango, 7 miles to the south. We're going to be joining a left base of runway 23. Venice traffic. So these people, it's, it's not the recommended, and I believe the best way to do it, is 1,500 feet, overfly the field, and then get an idea what's going on, then enter the traffic pattern. Don't do a straight in because you never know. If yeah. we would have done a straight in there in Venna, in our Wachula, and say we were headed south, landing on runway 18, we would have never seen the track, the tractors on the grass yeah. or whatever. And it's it's a good That's idea to, yeah, you know, we would have done a low approach. I was hoping to scare them away, and they, they're like, oh, I'm mowing the grass. So, And there may be a notum out there, which I didn't, I mean, it's called check. I didn't see any notums, and I'd look like a fool if I landed there. I mean, look. I'll check on the ground when we get there, because that could be okay. something else, too. To... I'll make a radio call now. Yes, sir. Finish traffic, Skyhawk 529 or 7 Golf. We are approximately 10 miles to the east 
uh, runway 23 will enter the traffic, left wind traffic, Venice. And Venice traffic, uh, one five tango. We are five miles to the uh, south. We're going to be joining a left base on runway two three. I think we're right in front of you over there. Put Skyhawk. And we'll uh, follow right behind you. Five two nine seven golf. Okay, sounds good. You guys using two three for Venice? Yep, two three. One. All right. I gotta look for him. He's five miles out, so. But don't worry about him. You stay at 1,500 feet. He's going to be in a pattern altitude because he's flying, uh, making a left base, which... And I guess I've done that in my life. I don't think it's a good idea. It's such a phenomenon to look at the clouds off the water. And then it's, you know, the ground warmed up and then... Where, where? Thank you. I want to get to my uh, right here. I mean, you can. You can okay. just come where you are. May just main the altitude is going to be the important part. Twenty, uh, fifteen hundred feet or no, or above, and then make your just understand that. Yeah, you know what? You're right because you don't want to be flying into traffic yeah, patterns. So yeah, exactly. you come over this way to the north and then come. Yeah, Randall and I had that discussion too. I, I just used a little common sense there yeah. on that. It's like, oh, I, I've never flown directly in. Yeah. Since I'll be making a left turn, I'll give myself enough space. Hey, and Benny's traffic, one five, turn, sure. one five tango turning, final runway two three. How many landings do you want to do here? Uh, maybe two. Okay. Call it a day. Fine for me. I want to just gauge whatever your uh, comfort level is. We've covered, covered a lot today. Good experience, good exposure to the taking off an instrument flight. Uh, you heard the radio communications and uh, made a good aeronautical decision by uh, you know, going, hey, going around and watching a lot. Final runway two, three. Bennett. Anything that happened today that you're uh, uncomfortable about or not happy about, or if turn everybody... coordinator, okay, um, power on stall. Power on stall was good though. The last one you did was good. Yeah, you just gotta re just know what you do. Don't oh, don't overthink it. Don't overthink it. Yeah. We just like to finish Time the stall. Time flies when we're flying, Daddy. Yeah. Uh, so multiple punts there, but it really goes by super fast. Got a lot accomplished, but we also been up in the air for a while. Yeah. Okay, time for a radio call. Looking outside for traffic. Yeah. Three miles to the north of the field, over flying. Good night, uh, traffic. Back to Sixth Avenue Hotel, left cross went off of 2 2 departing southeast. Good night. Finish traffic, 5297 Golf. We are north of the field, uh, running parallel to the uh, airfield, and we'll enter into our downwind left base. Finish traffic. And do what? I've been at 1 5 angles, clear 2 3. So, so just here's work. what you said, and uh, and so that's why I said what. You're north of the field, you're going to overfly the field, and they're left downwind base. So it, it's everything is going to be one different one. So you overfly the field at 1,500 feet or 2,000 feet, whatever. Uh, we'll enter a left downwind for runway 23, Venice. That's it. That makes sense? Left downwind, I think, here. 
Okay, you're not. Oh, okay, we're going. Yeah, yeah, we're going to cross the field. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it seems like I'm too high to cross over the field and then to enter downwind. Well, then get lower. <laughs> I mean, that's. I mean, that's, well, I, I, mean, I don't want to get so low that I'm going to interfere with someone taking off. Or, or well, you landing. won't because no one's here is in a helicopter that I've heard. There's no jets that I've heard. Traffic, uh, 957 through X-rays departing runway 23 for the downward departure to the east, uh, Venice. Okay, so he's departing. So you make your radio call. I don't. He's. You see him down there on the runway. He's ta taxing out. So I'm gonna make this radio call and just listen. Okay. Venice traffic. This is Cessna 97 Gulf. We're gonna overfly the field at uh, 1,500 feet, entering a left downwind for runway 23, Venice. So we've got the traffic. So now make your left turn. Go ahead and slow down to 2,000 RPM. And do a slow descent to 1,500. So 2,000 RPM, slow descent. We're, we're screaming in here right now. We're at 120. No, there. Okay. So you come out here and look over your... To you feel appropriate. I'm seeing that aircraft on the ground. Don't move. Don't be hyper-focused on him. We already know where he is. Okay. And it's he's also got a job to see us and look at us. He's better than most because he is going to... He's made radio calls. So, a uh, little bit too soon to turn. Okay. I, I would I would still go a little bit farther out. Okay. And then when you think it's appropriate, then you make your left downwind. Okay. I'll make it right now. Okay. Finish traffic. Skyhawk 5297 Golf making left downwind. Finish. Left downwind. That's right, three extras on the left crosswind. Left so downwind, 2-3, two, three, Venice. 2-3. Two, three. Okay. Got that. So all you did on that one is you had left rudder when you turned. Yeah, I, I noticed that. Okay, let's get down our altitude. You got uh, 1,500 RPM. Okay. Yeah. Again, uh, initiate. Yeah. 10 degrees of flaps. Let's bring the 1500 RPM out. There you go. Airspeed was fine. Look over your left hand shoulder, see where you are. I see. Yeah. That's Galera. That is traffic. Columbia 150 Lima Charlie departing runway 23. We'll fly runway heading Venice. Okay. Make your left turn when appropriate. Now. So you don't need left rudder. Make your left turn. Left turn here. Go. Look how much better turn that is, see? Oh yeah, much better. This traffic right after the floor to the south on the coast, going to enter left down one, two, three. Go check up. That guy sounds familiar. Who is that guy? Traffic 5297 Golf, making left base, runway 23, Venice. Wonderful. Eventually things will rub off, John. I tell you, you're doing a lot better than you think you are. I mean, you got. I know that. Well, you're... I, I don't feel. I, I don't feel discouraged. I mean, it's it's overwhelming because there's just so many integral but, par parts and pieces to what it is I'm trying to do. The limited bit I've I've known from working with you is that you are a perfectionist. Oh, hardly. Yeah. And, and uh, make my final turn now. Yeah. Skyhawk, uh, actually, finished traffic, 5297 Golf, making left final, runway 23, Venice. Venice traffic, 73 X rays, uh, clearance to the east in Venice. Okay. Now you're on yeah. final. Final. Degree, okay. uh, 20 degrees. Power modulate flight. your airspeed about 75 knots is where yeah. you want it. Everything looks really good right now. So you're going to use your rudder pedals. Just dance with the whole way down. Dance, the whole dance, goal dance. is to have. When I come down, right too. in the middle of the runway. Maintain your airspeed. You want 75 knots down. If, if, you if you've got too much, loud and clear. Uh, bring the power out. Idle. Yeah. Maintain your airspeed. 75 knots is perfect. We're a little high. Not bad. A little high. Yeah, we'll get down here. Okay. 
Cedar coming down. I want to be uh, careful on your speed, though. You do, but not, not I mean, abnormally so. Never land. Be, yeah. Okay, so you should be at idle, way at idle, a long time ago. Okay. All right, now just look down to the end of the runway. Hold it, hold it off. Don't, don't dive, don't dive. Okay, hold it off. Hold it, 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 hold it. Good job. Okay. Let's put, do a full stop. <laughs> you want to? Yeah. Okay. So let's, we got to slow down there. No brakes, just let no it work. Venice traffic 97 Golf will uh, be clearing the active here at the end of uh, 2 3. Okay. Are we at idle? I don't. Yep. Okay. Slowly application of brakes. Okay. You doing okay? Yep. Okay. Yeah, I just want to. Uh, Digest this. Okay. The thing that on that one, it looked as if, and so the traffic pattern when we're doing it. Right, extra turn to file, two, three. Let's just call clear when you're clear of the yep. road runway. Got all controls. Just like off, I want to quit while I'm ahead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Venice traffic, this is Cessna 5297 Gulf, is clear 2-3 at the end. Look at this idiot, he didn't even care, he's landing, here he comes. Why am I grabbing this? Grabbing what? <laughs> the yoke. Doesn't do anything, yeah, you're right. Leave, leave it alone. <laughs> um, okay, now we're right, so, Um. So let me go back to the runway. So, so you're saying don't don't nose dive. Well, that's what it seemed like because okay. so, and there's a, there's just different things about. It. So if you remember the power settings, well, I, I do remember this. I mean, the Pappy lights were both white, so we were high. What kind of plane is that? It's an experiment. I think it's a Columbia. Super fast, like an acrobatic plane. So, right there, I mean, uh, I didn't feel comfortable. I should have just. Uh, hey, Venice traffic, 158 Romeo yeah. is uh, holding Always an option. Two, three, uh, departing two, three. Right, extra left now, man. Out of all the landings I've done here in Venice, I've never done a full stop in Venice. Okay. So. Oh, well, we have for the pilot place, welcome to Venice. <laughs> Thank you. So it's uh, when you taxi, when you land, do a full stop here, it's uh, kind of like a um, a marathon to get back to the end of the runway. Oh, we got to stop, stop, and make the. Oh, I mean, not not jump on the brakes. I mean, but a good practice is we're about to cross an active runway. To so make the radio call and say Venice traffic, uh, you do this. Venice traffic at nine seven Golf is crossing one three three one at Echo. Venice traffic right after that base between. I have no idea. So after that, where do we go keep straight? Going, or? I know where I'm going. You keep going straight yep. up here. You'll make a left on Echo. There's no yeah, tower here. Echo. Finish traffic, 5297 Golf. We are hold short runway uh, 13 at Echo, Venice. We're crossing 138. Go ahead and just go. We've okay. already made the, the, no, no one's here. Okay. But yeah, just, you know, you're. Well, look at these guys. Look at this. This guy's a jerk over here. And this guy's who? The flight school. The this guy's guy like a, a guy, fighter Kamikaze. jet. I mean, it's like bananas, but yeah, he's, it's, it's an extra. So I thought it was a Columbia. It's an extra. All right, so I'm just going straight? Straight. Okay. Make a left there on Charlie. Left on Charlie. I mean, I think it's like, it could be 300 horsepower plane or more. They would get down. Touch back up. Fine, like a... So now it's just basically see and avoid, look for people. Venice traffic, radio check. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Right if going up here, you're, you're, the goal is to get over to there by that plane. So you got to go up here, follow that one over there. Oh, wait, it's like following the yeah. yellow brick road here. There's that nice barren. 
I've got so much time in those things. I've had so much fun flying that twin engine plane. It's the bigger airport than I thought. It's just it's a maze. But yeah, there's a lot of people so on hangers. Uh, people store their planes down here because it used to be cheaper than Sarasota. Want to do one takeoff, go to Sarasota, do another one here? Uh, we can do another one here and then... Got a guy in front of us. Okay. But he's on the ramp. Go ahead and go make your turn. So, which way are we going? Right turn. Right turn. The Honda jet there? Yeah. Is that a Honda? That might be a Vision Jet. Oh, Vision yeah, jet. yeah, that's a... Yeah, Vision Jet. Yeah, VJ, yeah. Vision Jet. I mean, it looks like it's not supposed to fly. It looks Venice, like... Venice, 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 I one time, uh, you can eat breakfast here. I one time I got my daughters up and I flew them down here to have breakfast. Okay. A lot of fun. Yeah, hundred dollar hamburger or hundred dollar pancake as that was at that time. <laughs> better, better been good, huh? No, it better have been. A lot of fun though. I like incorporating them with flying. Let's try to right after uh, left down when it's like All right, down. let's get in front of these guys. Did you say you wanted to leave here or do a touch and go here? You know what? We can uh, just leave here. Okay. Yeah. I'm not forcing you. You, no, no, you drive I'm, this. Okay. I, I want to no. make sure you're getting your bank for your buck. Where'd the guy go? He's uh, he's there. Okay. There. So just say you're holding short. Yeah. Runway two three at Alpha. Yeah. Or you can just wait till you have to make a call. I mean, you got in front of these guys, which is good. Venice traffic five two nine seven Golf. We are holding short runway two three at Alpha Venice. And we'll be... Uh, Avenue yeah, traffic, Skyhawk 726, Mike Bravo, we're holding short at 2-3 and sequence behind 9-7 uh, Golf. North, uh, north uh, departure in a minute. I mean, that's a responsive plane. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Not even landing, is he? No, he is. is. Okay, go ahead, take the active. You got it. Okay. This traffic, back to 9-7 Golf. On runway 23, Alpha Venice. Outbound departure. Outbound departure, Venice. Okay, there you go. So let's do our, you got our lights, you're all set to go. Okay, And where's our air guy? Got to hold him position until he either takes off or leaves. Yeah, I see him right there, sitting on the runway. And Venice traffic, Skyhawk 726, uh, Mike Bravo, lining up on wait, runway 23. Right, He's clear, 23, Venice. You're good to go. Hey. Feels the floor right Look at this guy. Way. Mike Bravo's right behind them. This is nuts. It's like we're at a radio, a rodeo. Okay. Airspeed is alive. Got the pedals? Yeah. Got to get those pedals here. Rotate. Okay. Good job. Traffic, one o'clock. Did you want to or not? Did you and we, we can go. No, what, what do you want to do? Uh, we, I have nothing until 4 o'clock, so we, I don't think we, you want to fly until 4, but... Uh, I think I'm getting a little tired, though. Okay. Now look at your turn, right? You're coordinated. Yeah. I'm not even looking at that. I'm... <laughs> go figure. So what I want to do is I want to level off at 1,000 feet, and let's see if we can sneak into Sarasota. Sneak into Sarasota. You okay with that? Yeah. Sneak it in, it'll be quicker for us. 
maintain a thousand feet, not five foot, but you still could do a thousand. Yeah. I do the radio. Oh, gotta get to your uh, 1,000 feet. Um, uh, you can make the radio call if you like. I mean, I do you want to do it? I, I could do it. Okay. I so don't know. I don't know what you. Oh, want so me to do. here's what so. we're gonna do. So let's let's get to 1,000. Let's slow our speed a little bit, and we'll kind of talk through it. We can't get only so close. So in about three miles, we're gonna have to make our radio call. So you're gonna say Sarasota Tower, 5297 Gulf, and they'll say 5297 Gulf. Go ahead. Yes, sir. We're 15 miles south of Sarasota Gulf. Full stop. Yeah, I can do that right now. Okay. You are up with tower. Tower. Go ahead. This is a tower of 5297 Gulf. We are. That's it. Then let them come back to you. Okay. Runway four, clear for the option. Clear for the option, runway four, 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 Okay, so make a call again. Tower, Cirrus 189er, Whiskey Mike. Say Cirrus on the tower, 5297, nothing else. When he's done with this guy. Yeah. Cirrus 189er, Whiskey Mike, Cirrus on the tower, runway one, four, clear for takeoff. And I'll jump clear in and we'll take off runway one, four, one, eight, nine, Whiskey Mike. This. Sarasota Tower, 5297 Gulf. 5297 Gulf, Sarasota Tower. 5297 Gulf, we are 15 miles south of the tower, like uh, the full stop with information Gulf. 7 Gulf, squawk 0147. Squawking 0147, 5297 Gulf. Great. So now we can enter their airspace because we got two-way yeah. radio communication and transponder, so we're good to go. Okay. So, thousands of better feet out to get at. In six ten room Delta, yeah, go ahead. Uh, how are you looking on arrivals in about like 20, 30 minutes? Uh, I mean, there's, there's some arrivals, but they're pretty spread out. Okay, perfect. Uh, if we could get a full stop on this one, uh, I'm going to hop out of the plane over at Dolphin and let my students, so... Uh, in six ten room Delta, right? Sarasota Tower, Belanca 73 Kilo Papa, ready for takeoff at Charlie, runway 1-4. Like a 73 Kilo Papa, Sarasota Tower, runway 14, clear for takeoff. No delay around the corner, traffic is uh, left base, runway 4. 3 Kilo Papa, clear for takeoff, no delay, thank you. So um, 3 Kilo Papa, cancel takeoff, clearance, runway 14, line up and wait. Uh, next arrival for your runway is on an 8 mile left base. Okay, uh, changing for uh, lining up and wait for 73 Kilo Papa, 14. Exit at 354, visual 14. So jet 354, Sarasota Tower, runway 14, continue, traffic holds in position. Continue exit. Good job with the altitude. Thank you. In six never in Delta, extend down when I'll call the base. Extend down when you're car base, six number delta. Center seven golf follow the coastline northbound, I'll call the uh, turn inbound. Following coastline, you'll call uh, us about two hours of the Gulf. Perfect. That's low tide, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. 
one got three kilo popper, runway one four, clear for takeoff. Then three kilo popper, clear for takeoff. Thank you. Cirrus nine whiskey Mike, contact departure today. Over to departure, so long one eight nine whiskey Mike. Exojet three fifty four, runway one four, clear to land. Clear to land one four, Exojet three fifty four. We're 91 Fox, right, extend up when I'll call the crosswind. Next step up, boys, we'll the Buffalo 91 Fox up. feet's fine. I just usually okay. do 1,000 because it's easy, but 1,100 is fine too. Get to 1,200, then you're in, uh, you don't want to. 216 never in Delta, turn base. 216 never in Delta, turn base, uh, right now. What do you think, 04? Oh, yeah. Better to do this coming off of Venice when they're landing 04 because it's. Tower Baron 99 Tango Delta. Easy. Inbound, coming up on approval. Baron 99 Tango Delta, Sarasota Tower runway 14, clear to land. I'm going to be doing 14, maybe. Well, I got three kilo pavic on the right there. We'll do it. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you can as do it as another option. Sure. We'll have to wait for him to. For, for us, uh, I think four is better because we can land and yeah. then get closer to being done. I mean, to the runway and not have to do a lot of taxiing. This is Tower, Cherokee 9614, Charlie, holding short at uh, 14, uh, ready for takeoff. Cherokee 9614, Charlie, Roger, hold short at your runway, 14. Hold short at 14, 9614, Charlie. Look at what you're doing right now, though. You're not thinking about it, and look at how well you're flying. So when you, I think one thing we have learned is you are overthinking a lot of things because you're flying very, very well right now. Yeah. You've maintained our altitude plus or minus 50 feet. Our heading has been no issues at all. Everything is going no just fine. Grip. You're not yeah, even on coordinated. this. I mean, the, the turn coordinator is perfectly coordinated wings level. So I guess if it's anything to say is don't think about what you're doing and just do it because you know what to do. That, does that part make sense? It makes absolute sense. I, I try to complicate too many things. Because you can do this. I'm watching you do this. I've said nothing or done nothing. You've even made kind of a complex... Sure, 91 Fox Rock crosswind and downwind approved. Extend downwind, I'll call the base. Kind of a complex request of the tower that you don't normally do. The squeaking in under Tampa because they're going to vector us all over the world. And then this way it's like just come up here and make a right. Beautiful Sarasota. Yes, sir. Sarasota Tower, Columbia 150, Lima Charlie. Columbia 150, Lima Charlie, Sarasota Tower, make straight in runway 04, runway 4, clear to land. 150, Lima Charlie, I'll make straight in for 04, clear to land. Exojet 354, say parking. Uh, going to Castle first, Exojet 354. Exojet 354, turn right at Bravo, contact ground point 9. Okay, Bravo at tw 21.9, extra jet 354. And 316 November Delta, are we clear to land for? 316 November Delta, perimeter runway 4, clear to land. 4, clear to land, thanks. 316 November Delta. And 7 Golf, make a left 360. Traffic you're following is, a, well, let's see if you see him first. Columbia, 11 o'clock, 3 you. miles, turning final for runway 04. Is that for us? Say. They're at 2000. Okay, uh, Nine seven Gulf, negative contact, we're looking. Did you still want us to do a 360? Yeah, let's do a left 360. They are descending, but still at 1700. Okay, left 360, we're looking for traffic. Uh, we do have the traffic in sight for 97 Gulf. 97 Gulf, follow them, and then runway 4, continue. Okay, we'll stop the 360. We do have the traffic in sight. We'll slow it up, and we'll follow behind the, uh, the Columbia traffic. Okay, you do see him, right? I called him. Yeah, I saw him. Turn six number from Delta, left turn at the end. Let's contact slow up. Let's practice oh, yeah. slow flight. And uh, contacting ground. Six number Delta. So make a square turn uh, when it comes time to turn your base. Okay. He's a super fast plane, so. Yeah. I'll let him get down. Air 9 Tango Delta, turn right, contact ground point 9. We're okay to follow. We can turn inbound if you want to, and it will work on slow flight, okay? Okay. Square turn, and I've got the traffic in sight. And uh, they may need us to do an S turn, but we'll focus on that later. You see it?
Yeah, I see, I'll see him. Yep. I've got him. He's coming right on the shoreline. Yeah, see him there. I mean, that's a super high performance aircraft. Morning, Tower, United 1401 approaching uh, Frugal. And 1401, sir, so Tower and Way 14, clear to land. Clear to land 14, 1401. That tower, check 9614, Charlie. We're holding short of 14, ready for takeoff. He's already home. 9614, Charlie, Roger. I don't have him now, but we can follow him still. We'll see him come over the trees, I think. Yeah. Okay, so you right now, your job is to get your speed down. Okay. Tower Challenger 822 Lima Lima, holding short of 1 4 ready. Challenger 822 Lima Lima, Roger. I see him now. He's to the right side of the run. Uh, not somebody taxi. Don't know where he is. I'm going to hold off on the uh, flaps. Well, I mean, you, you're going to want to slow, slow down, down some, so do put one notch. One notch of flaps. Yeah. And keep coming down. Inside my golf, make one tight right 360, then one way forward, clear to land. Okay, one uh, tight right 360, then we'll be cleared to land on one uh, four zero. Uh, or, I'm sorry, that's difficult. Oh, my God. Okay, make a, a, a right st a steep turn, a decrease of power, 2,000 RPM. Make it a tight, a tight one. It's just for spacing. Now watch your out there. Nose is coming up. Or I should say, watch your airspeed. Nose is coming up. Zero Lima, Charlie. Really good job. Zero okay, now our nose is high. Right. Airspeed's going to yep. come low. So now you're going to keep drop it. Yeah, yeah, there you go. No, no, I don't. All right. And wait, 1,100. Okay, you want to keep the throttle at least should be at 1,500. Your airspeed needs to be at 85. Or, sorry, 75. What's your eight limits here, sir? So the tower reduced in the final traffic is uh, landing runway four, two and a half mile final at Skyhawk. Where does the final eight limits here? Okay, idle. Idle. Once they get a little close to the uh, shoreline, do uh, 20 degrees of flaps. Okay, bring the throttle back to idle. And then, like, get the airspeed more under control. Yeah. You okay. 20, 20 degrees. degrees. Okay. Over 91 Fox right turn base. I'm going to increase the base from one and a third. 75 knots is perfect. Yeah. But you're a little high, a little high so just, yeah, just drop make down that down. adjustment. There you go. Go so altitude. 1401, contact ground point nine. Oh, is controlled by what? Uh, I can't concentrate on that. Uh, okay, power. Power uh, for altitude, okay. picture speed. There you go. Yeah. Okay, so now we're at the bottom end of where you want to be, so you're, yeah. and you're getting slow, you do what? Crease, throttle, yeah. just pitch up a bit. Good morning, Tower Blue 5331, we're on the visual one. low, you want to be this slow? 5331, Sarasota Tower, start reducing the final okay. approach speed when able, traffic will hold in position, runway 14, continue. Now I can pull okay, the for continue, we'll power the final approach still, your airspeed is dreadfully low, though. So that's why you got to increase your, decrease your, no, 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 no power, it's pitch. So our right? 632 Alpha is ready to go in sequence at Charlie. So you lower the nose. Out, Roger. Okay, look outside, dance with your feet, dance with your feet, dance with your feet. Okay, slow, hold it off. Oh, you got the rudder pedal, rudder coming. Yeah. Okay, not bad, not bad at all. Okay. I got the plan. Thank you, clear to land for Aileen and Sheriff. Aileen and Sheriff, permitted runway 14, clear to land. Clear to land 14, Aileen and Sheriff. Talk 97 Golf, left turn when you like, contact ground point 9. Okay, 97 Golf, we'll, uh, we'll clear as soon as we can here and on ground point 9, thanks. Hotel? Oh, yeah, we should have, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. But we got a guy behind us, so we don't. So the throttle management is something that we need to work in, so you got really, really slow. Yeah, I noticed that. Okay. Didn't want to jam on the brakes to. Uh, no, that's smart. You know, 
1,090. Um, at or below 1,600. VFR, of course, by the way. Tampa, Tracon, 1965 in a squawk code of 0112, ma'am. CBM 0 Lee Max, we back, correct? Cross runway 4, taxiway Charlie. Contact the yes, ground, say we're clear the exit. Correct. We're now crossing runway 4 on Charlie uh, on our way to runway 14 for TBM Lee Max, right? To 1.9. I've got it done for Ground you. exit. That's tower, I already had it done. Golf at the Retrix Jet Center, ready taxi. Exit Jet 793, Sarasota Ground. We're on hotel to the ramp. 14 taxi via Julia Charlie. 1-4 via Julia and Charlie, uh, Exojet 793. Exojet 793, and hold short runway 04 at Charlie, please. Yes, ma'am, we'll hold short of runway 04 at Charlie, Exojet 793. Zero set ground, front two nine seven go, we're clear runway 04 at hotel. Uh, ready to trans, uh, taxi to the panel, please. I'm right there, sir, golf taxi to park straight ahead. Parking straight ahead, 97 go. Number 0 Lima, Charlie, give way to a TBM taxiing left to right on Charlie, please. They're going to be ahead in tier left. 150 Lima, Charlie, Alma, Swamp. What do you think? Uh, <laughs> Every day I go up, uh, I'm learning something new. I feel better on Sierra, things that I have done. Hold position for now. There's going to be um, a citation. This last landing, speed, speed was slow. Hold position, Amy Monsieur. Ground, uh, all in all, I think I'm good. position at Retro Trek. I'm feeling good. Exit just 793, Roger, cancel, tax instructions. I agree with you, I think you did do well on this. I mean, there's a little thing to just like, it's fine-tuning things. If we could get the fog to stay away, we could focus only on on landing. Give me the fog in the sky and the fog in my brain. Change to my frequency, one to one point nine, or stand by your number three. At least I know where I'm going, you know, before I was fumbling around with stuff. No, you got you're doing fine. United, uh, 12, 12 November 150, Lima Charlie, cross runway 14, taxiway Fox Drop, continue taxiing via Alpha. Are you familiar? 150, Lima Charlie, affirmative, and uh, I'll cross 14 to Alpha. United 1215, sir, sit again. Hey, can we uh, pull up uh, on the Bravo and make a 180 back onto the ramp? United 1215, approved as requested. Thank you. Uh, 180 on Bravo, back on the ramp, 9150. Check card 453, thanks for your patience. Advise ready, copy, please. Ready. Check card 453, you're clear to the Bravo Uniform Fox Red Airport via the Circus 4 departure as filed. On departure, maintain 3000. Expect flight level 410, one zero minutes after departure. Tampa departure 119.65, clock 6001. Syracuse 4 departure. This is here, make a uh, little fast. We don't want to just move when you're by aircraft. You don't want to get to a uh, hit one. Do you want to spin this around? Check yeah, card 453. Check card 453. We're back. Correct. Device ready. Taxi. Good Southwest job. 2531. Thanks for your patience. Device ready. Copy. Good job. Good. Southwest 2531. You're clear. LaGuardia Airport via Circus 4 departure. Camjo transition. Send us files. On departure, maintain 3000. Expect flight level 410, one zero minutes after departure.